All right, welcome back uh, to another exciting episode of Managing Through a Pandemic, uh, focused on safety and well-being of the community, partially through good communication. Uh, we have a special guest, um, uh, the lioness of all things that are good and right and wholesome in the village, uh, Ashley Wright, our Director of Library and Community Activities. Welcome. Thank welcome. you. And uh, just a couple of quick notes uh, before we move on to the, the important uh, things in, in the agenda. Um, uh, thanks to staff, uh, you did a great job uh, this past holiday weekend. We had a lot of uh, visitors as, as expected in the village, um, but uh, your foresight to uh, have extra police officers and folks from Public Works and other departments with uh, scouting for, for trash and garbage uh, really turned out well. So uh, well done staff, thanks so much. A couple of other quick notes. We did, um, we did post the building official position for recruitment this week. I look forward to uh, the police commander, mm -hmm. your old job chief, a police dispatcher and a firefighter paramedic coming up next. And then um, next week I'll, I'll give you more detail about the March council agenda, but just, uh, just a, a couple of uh, things to pique your interest potentially. We've got a forest and beach appeal of some tree removals, uh, Pittosporum I think they were, and then a presentation on our unfunded pension liability and mitigation options. The excitement never ends around here. Chief, what do you have real fast before we turn on to? Uh, uh, yeah, real uh, quickly, uh, uh, as far as vaccines, no real update on numbers increasing or anything in our community, but we are getting ready. Our ambulance personnel were trained last week uh, and this past week on how to administer it. So we're ready. Um, we're working on a site, so we'll be ready for that as well. When we get more vaccines available, uh, if you read the pine cone last night or this morning, you saw a front page article about the mountain lions. Uh, we are seeing an increase in sightings. I don't think I don't think it was a mountain lion. I think it was Ashley delivering books to a senior. It's like the Easter scenic. Bunny, but better. Yeah, <laughs> Ashley might be doing early morning runs, so it might be a leopard you're seeing, but it's we're a cheetah. I think lions. it's a cheetah. It is cheetah. Cheetah, sorry. I don't leopard. run, but yes. Keep an eye out for mountain lions. As a hiker, I'm always keeping my eyes out, and I have received several important text messages from my mother warning me about the mountain lions. Thank you, Mom in Oregon. Okay. We'll put out some safety information in the Friday letter. Thanks, Chief. That's all I got. Um, so I'm here today to give you guys a little bit of an update about community activities and special events here in town, as you all know. Um, we have a number of special events occurring throughout the spring, like Breakfast with the Bunny, for instance, Carmel Art Festival, Monterey Vintners, some of these things, like the art festival, is we're looking at a to-be-determined date for that. Um, the Vintners has been canceled, and the Breakfast with the Bunny event, which is um, typically held Easter weekend, um, come to the farmer's market the Thursday before, and you'll um, be able to grab some pancake takeaway um, there. So we've kind of figured out a workaround for that event, and um, I'll be doing a more in-depth update with council for all of our events, especially the city events, as we get into the fall. Um, we're just kind of playing it by ear. As Chief said, there's no real announcements on the vaccine update and how long that's taking, and that'll be really an important factor in having large-scale events for our village. In the meantime, if you enjoy trying to figure out workarounds for large-scale events and community gatherings and topics like Christmas lights, for instance, come to the Community <laughs> Activities Committee, um, Commission meetings. Um, we're having a great time. We have a lot of our community groups that are joining us now, like Carmel Cares is there on the regular, so is the Carmel Residents Association. We meet virtually every Tuesday. That's the second Tuesday of the month at 9.30 in the morning. Um, we're also having special meetings every other week, so the second week following that. Um, if we have a special topic, something pressing that we really need to get to, but tune in that first, that second Tuesday of the month and we'll be there. Um, and then speaking of lions, um, the library is uh, hosting the Lions Food Barrels outside um, the Park Branch. Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, you'll find them with your books. If you're picking up books, um, please drop off your perishable food items if you have them. Um, and then Mondays and Tuesdays, when the library is closed to curbside, the barrels will be out at the front door and the back door. And speaking of the library, um, we are doing curbside Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. If you don't internet or you know somebody that doesn't internet and would really like some books, have them give us a call, 624-4629, and we can get them set up. They don't need to do anything with, the, they don't need to have a computer, and we'll still manage to get them books. Um, and in fact, we're working with Carmel Neighbors right now to kind of set up an outreach program for some of our uh, people who are homebound. So if you know anybody that is very in need, contact me, 
at the library, um, contact our librarians, again, 624-4629, and we'll get you set up. On behalf of the Mission Trail Lions, thank you for putting the food barrels out. And I know Carmel Host is also appreciative of that. So Glad to you. help. Proud lion, proud lion. Why do we even do this? I mean, that was that was much more relevant than usually anything that we say. Yeah, you're, you, can you come back each week? Sure, we have got all <laughs> kinds of things going on. Well, thank you for joining us. You're always thank welcome you here, and thank you for doing what you do for the village and, and the rest of the team, so. All right. Thank you both. All okay, right, thanks. well done, that's it. All right. What do we say? I don't remember. Hi to your mom. Oh, sorry, okay. hey mom. And take good care. Take so, good care. Hi mom, hi dad. Take good care. <laughs>